Three teens shot within about an hour of each other in Rochester today. One of them has died. So a lot of questions remain around these incidents. We're going to run through what we know, starting with the scene over on Alphonse Street where that deadly shooting took place. Alex Love is live there now for us with the details. Alex, what do we know? Well, in just the last few minutes, Adam, North Street has opened back up. The police are still on scene, and they have the 300 block of Alphonse Street right behind me closed, which remains an active scene. Police have been here since a little bit before 2.30 p.m. Now, several houses behind me is where they discovered a teenage male once they arrived who had been shot once, at least in the upper body. He was pronounced dead at the scene. While on the scene, police say officers then located a man who had an illegal handgun and chased him down. At this time, police say there's no indication that this man is a suspect in the dead shooting. However, he was taken into custody for questioning. Officers were able to develop information about who that person was that possessed the illegal handgun. Obviously, I think you, you saw the officers running towards the danger and uh, apprehending safely the armed person who had the illegal handgun. Uh, obviously, these scenes are very dynamic, and um, uh, as you can see, it's a pretty intense situation. So I guess it, it bears uh, to the fact that these officers are extremely brave because they see a person armed with an illegal weapon and they immediately run towards danger putting themselves at risk while making every single possible effort to take the person into custody safely and without incident. Now, it is still early in the investigation, but police say if you have any information or know about this shooting, you are urged to call 911, where your tips can always remain anonymous. Live in Rochester, Alex Love, News 8. All right, Alex, thank you so much. So that's the scene over on Alphonse Street, that neighborhood now around two for excuse me, around 2.40 at the intersection of Remington and Lang Streets, RPD. They're telling us they found another teenage male who had been shot. He was transported to the hospital and is being treated for life-threatening injuries. The circumstances that led to that shooting are still under investigation. As we mentioned, two other teens were shot in the Rochester area around this time. Around 1.30, RPD responded to St. James Street where they found a 17-year-old with a gunshot wound. He was rushed to the hospital and is expected to survive. Police said they have one person in custody in that incident.